Hello and welcome to the Django Celery Mastery course. Just a quick reminder, if you like this course and would like to access the source code and more, you can access this course on Udemy. The link to the course, which should provide the best price, is in the video description. The second component that we're going to be building is the message broker. Now, the message broker in the context of Celery is a system or intermediary that enables communication between the task producer, the sender, the application, and the task consumer, the receiver, in the distributed task queue. So it acts as a messaging middleware, if you like, facilitating the exchange of messages or tasks between the components or processes. So the message broker then receives the task from the message provider. It stores and then puts them in a queue. So the Celery worker is then going to uh, detect the fact that there is a new message and then the message broker will deliver these tasks to the consumer or workers, sorry, for processing. So the broker is going to ensure the reliable message delivery. It's going to handle task prioritization and it's going to manage task distribution across if we have multiple workers. Now, although we are using Redis for our message broker, it's well worth noting that there are other popular message brokers, including RabbitMQ, maybe Apache Kaf, uh, Kafka, I think it is. They provide, they all provide, sorry, the infrastructure for efficient task management and coordination, allowing us to create a scalable and reliable task execution and distribution system.